no sign of slowing down anytime soon. Today, according to AAA, the average price of gasoline in North Carolina is 402 a gallon for regular. That's 10 cents higher than yesterday and nearly 50 cents more than just last week and more than 75 cents over where it was just a month ago. News Channel 12 star Connor went to the local Walmart where we found some of the lowest prices at $3.97 a gallon. And star, some people are driving longer distances now just to save a few pennies. That's right, Frank. I spoke with the AAA spokesperson and she tells me it all depends on what type of car you drive as to whether if you drive further distance that will save you money looking in search of gas. Now, people I spoke to say that they are nervous and worried about this spike. Car after car lined up at the Walmart pumps on News Boulevard in New Bern. People say they are trying to find the cheapest gas in town. I would drive a little bit further because I could get more for my money. Small business owner Pete D. Donato says it cost him almost $50 more within 48 hours just to fill up his tank. We're like right here, so this was this was $4.59 a gallon for diesel. Uh, and right there at the at the BP, 10 feet away, it's $5.09. So yeah, I'll absolutely drive 10 feet to save. 50 cents a gallon. AAA spokesperson Tiffany Wright says prices at the pump climbed an average of 47 cents this week in North Carolina. She says there is a lot of factors that come into play on whether driving longer distances to find cheaper gas is beneficial. I mean, are you are you driving an SUV? Are you driving a smaller car? You know, what 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 does it really um, what does your vehicle require? And you have vehicles that require premium uh, fuel. And so right there, it, may, it might be worth your while to drive that extra 10 miles to make the saving. As for drivers like D. Donato, he says it's not just the gas prices he's worried about. It's the future of the economy. My fear is that my family and my neighbor's families aren't going to be able to put food in their car or gas in their car and food in their belly, be able to go to work and support themselves. Now gas prices can vary as much as 10 or 15 cents in a small area. Doing a little bit of homework could save you some money. In the newsroom, Star Connor for News Channel 12. And we have a resource on our website, WCTI12.com, and it'll help you make the best choices when it comes to buying gasoline. On our gas prices page, we have prices for stations where you are reported within the past 24 hours. Just go to the news section and find gas prices. President Joe Biden announces an official ban on Russian oil imports.